The I Matter program is designed to decrease the teen birth rate in West and Southwest Philadelphia. One of the most important components of this program is its youth leadership team. My name is Omar, I'm 18 years old. I go to Loyola University, Maryland, and I've been a part of the RIOC going on like, uh, what, three, four years. My name is Kaneda Shields. I go to Bowie State University and I've been a part of the team for four and a half years. I started as a summer internship and uh, uh, the program manager at the time, Tiffany, told me about it and uh, that's when I decided to get involved. <laughs> Tiffany told me that it was a teen pregnancy prevention initiative. She told me that we would be reaching out to the community, engaging in other youth, and going to different schools, and engaging in different activities to get other youth to get on point with how this was a serious matter. And um, we wanted to reduce the teen pregnancy rate in the areas of West and Southwest Philadelphia. changed a lot when I would like because before like you would hear like I would hear things regarding like teen pregnancy probably ignore it probably not say anything but then like from being in the wild tea I felt like I was like obligated every time someone said something about that was like inaccurate about birth control or inaccurate about teen pregnancy I was I was like uh, an advocate or you could say and I had to like speak up and tell them tell what the what was true and like tell people about their options because like I had the information so I had the uh, obligation to share it. Being a part of Wild Tea was great. Um, it was a very educating learning experience. Um, we were able to learn ourselves but also educate other people. Uh, we reached out to a lot of different youth. We were able to reach out to our friends, our families, and even neighbors within the community just to educate them on things that they didn't know. I found that a lot of people did not know information about sexual health, nor did they know about the high rate of teen pregnancy. And um, when they found out we were trying to prevent teen pregnancy within the areas, it was great because we got to know a lot of different people. We got to experience um, different activities, just knowing that we could help others made a difference. Like I would say like before the YLT, like my goals were to like become a doctor. And then after the YLT, I would say like my goals changed from just becoming a doctor to uh, establishing community organizations that target health disparities. Back in 2012 um, and 2013, we took pictures um, going through the park, um, different areas, and we were told that we were going to be put on a campaign. We knew that it was going to spread, but we didn't know it was going to spread like that. Um, I think that with our social media campaign, we actually got the word across, and we got the word out there to other youth and other schools and different parents and other families and they really seen what I Matter Philly was about. My name is Tiffany Thompson um, and while working with the YLT as program coordinator I really thought it was important for young people to have their voice heard. Um, I think that for myself, youth development is a really, really important issue for me, building young people capacity to make really smart decisions for their future, whether that's what school they're going to go to for college, or where can I find condoms, or what should I do when I'm in a relationship with a young woman or a young man. I think that empowering young people to make their own smart decisions um, is really the basis for really smart and impactful youth development. Um, so that's why I think the YLT 
is an incredible asset to Access Matters and an incredible asset to teen pregnancy prevention in West and Southwest Philadelphia.